So today I'm going to show you how to find thesis and dissertations on the university institutional repository called the Kofsi Scholar. Not only do we host thesis and dissertation there, but also research articles by university staff as well as university journal publications. So you go onto the university's website, ufs.ac.za, and you click on library. Now that you've landed on the library's homepage, you hover over resources. And if you look down there is Kofsi Scholar, so you click on Kofsi Scholar. So the easiest way to use this is going to be the following. First, you find your community. So we're going to go and search just for today's exercise, National Agricultural Sciences, and we click on it. Then, the next thing you scroll down and look at the sub-communities and you find whichever department you're from, I'm going to go to plant sciences. Now, the next thing you do, if you scroll down, you'll see here's a search box. You'll see collections in this community. So maybe you want to look at doctoral degrees, maybe at masters, and look, I said there was research articles, there's conference proceedings. Also, this list shows recently added publications for today, we're going to go look at Masters. So we first click on whichever degree you want to check. So we're going to go Masters. And now I want you to do the following. You see the search box on the right? You can click in the type in there, but I want you to do this first. You click on this collection. If you click on this collection, it's going to look in Natural Agricultural Sciences, in Plant Sciences, in Masters Degrees. Otherwise, it's going to search the entire Kofsi Scholar and you're going to be very frustrated. So we're going to type a keyword in there. You can type whatever keyword and we're going to say go. And remember, this collection is selected. And then it shows you anything with your keyword in it. Your keyword is highlighted over there. Over here, I don't see the keyword. There's breeding. So what, do you, what happens now? You can add another keyword after plant breeding. So you go to advanced filters and you can type in another filter and you can set the facet. Must have been a subject or wherever. Okay. And this is the same as the Boolean operators and or not. So that's for you to decide. I'm not going to do it right now. And then you can go and browse. So what happens? Let's say maybe you want to see what this one's about. So you click on it. There's an abstract. There's a PDF. You open it. You save it. You might want to print it. That's up to you. But you open it there and you save it. And there you have an entire thesis by Mashamba NT. Thank you, it's as easy as that.